information tonight on some breaking news from last night. We have learned it was a murder-suicide that claimed the lives of three family members at their Pickens County home. One of the victims was a high school student. Daniel Smith was a ninth grader at Easley High School. And now we want to show you a look at the scene from last night where deputies found Daniel and his mother shot to death inside their home. And his stepfather was found dead outside the home. It's a case that has touched the hearts of many people in Pickens County and really all over our area. Fox Carolina's Greg Thunderberg has the story. This makeshift memorial stands just a few feet from where 15-year-old Daniel Smith, his mother, and stepfather were found dead Thursday night. Today, classmates came to sign the poster, leave mementos, and others just grieved. He was one of my friends. Like, we were just starting to get close. The sign has Daniel's name on it, as well as the number 51. It's the number he wore on the junior varsity football team. It's a double murder-suicide that has left his classmates in shock. Everybody bombarded me at the door, and, um... They were telling me how Daniel has passed. And Just last night, Pickens County school officials tell me Daniel played football here in the JV Stadium against Seneca High School. He played well. Um, again, it was the second game of the season. So the big question today is what happened and why? It appears to have been an ongoing domestic for quite some time. Just after 10 o'clock, deputies say Daniel's mom, Sandy Smith, was shot in the dining room. They say her husband then went to Daniel's bedroom and shot him under the chin before he died. Daniel managed to call 911. He said that he had been shot and send, uh, send deputies. Once deputies arrived on scene, they heard a gunshot. Daniel's stepfather, 61-year-old William Thomas, had killed himself. Tonight, family and friends are working to deal with this triple tragedy. I don't miss, like, his personality. He, he was always funny. In Pickens County, Greg Funderburg, Fox Carolina News Tonight. Just an awful situation there. Now, coming up a little later in this newscast, we'll show you how Daniel Smith was honored by the Easley football team and the school district during tonight's football game.